I think it was literally the second day you just walked into the kitchen and put your hand on the kitchen table where I was and said, Mom, I think I'm going to be okay. And I said, yes, I think you are. I know you are. Hopeway is a mental health treatment center where we are able to help folks recover from various mental health issues, whether it be bipolar disorder, schizophrenia, major depressive disorder, anxiety disorders. What we want to help people realize is that it's nothing to be afraid of or ashamed of. It's something to be recognized, addressed, and, and to work and to heal from. I was just a, a going to school, just kind of just a normal guy. For a long time, you know, I hadn't felt like myself. I hadn't uh, had fun doing anything. This, this thing just reared its ugly head out of nowhere. And it, I mean, I lost like a good bit of time of my life to it. We realize that there's some people who can sit down right away and talk to a therapist and open up easily. There's some people who aren't comfortable with that, but they may be comfortable using art as an outlet. There's some folks who may need the help of a therapy dog just to get used to the idea of warming up and feeling secure and feeling comfortable. And at Hope Way, we seek to offer all of those options in order to meet people where they are, in order to help them get where they want to be. In many ways, I think mental illness has the stigma because it's perceived by others as a weakness. Hope Way not only believes in treating the client and involving the client and empowering them to take control of their illness, but also incorporating the family. There are so many families who don't survive mental illness in a number of ways, you know. I'm just very grateful that the son that I raised is back. <laughs> Today I'm looking at going back to school. I fully expect to have a job and just sort of go up, go about living my life, you know. When I visualize hope, I literally do look at the H in the Hopeway sign that has a crack through the middle of the age. It's as though walking that path of pain and experience and humility, and it's the one you walk through to get to hope. And uh, I feel like we have, we've walked that path and are continuing to. So I, I have hope for the future, yeah. lots of hope.